it seemed like making the albums was just torture because there, you would be stuck in the studio for months and then um, certain members of the band would come in with song ideas that would further delay the making of the album and because they had to mess about with all this new technology, you, you kind of got stuck just hanging out for days on end. It, it, it wasn't like that at first. I mean, it's, it's actually detailed in the book. The I used to do the production, I used to stay in the studio all the time, me and my job. So we would be there all the time. I mean, the, um, the synthesizers don't help <laughs> doing things quickly. But I have to say that computers help a damn sight less. Uh, they always say that computers were invented by studio owners, so they would make money. And uh, I did, did think that from 91 onwards they were probably absolutely right. But no, I mean, there was, you know, the thing about it is, is that it's like any relationship. Um, over a long period of time, people change. They get different ideals. They have different ideas for the music. They have different ideals for the group. <coughs> And, you know, taste does change. I mean, they call it musical differences, don't they? But we know what it comes down to in the end. It's like that very thing that attracts you at the start is the thing that repels you at the end, like any love affair. And, you know, once the sex is gone, then that's it.